Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Pakret Down the Bun Burrows. Last time, we just had such a meandering failure of progress. I'm trying and failing to make progress in going through these kind of northeast, southwest sections. Or northeast, southeast, southwest, northwest sections in all these new ways that I've learned I can manipulate things. But so far, like up here, that top left corner could be somewhere I could break out. But the problem with that is going to be if I can even do it with one bun, yet alone two. If I send this guy. Now, I'm going to need to use my trap here. If I put that trap there. Well, they're going to run straight ahead, aren't they? So that clearly didn't work. But if I could get them to go up into the dead end, just above me here in this corner, it would break the tile if I do it with two buns, and possibly lead to new and exciting places. But clearly, I'm in the wrong place for that. And this is an even worse place for that. So get me back to Hell Crossroads. Now, I think I've already done a pass. This is where we first learned about the whole thing. So we can probably really quickly recreate what we learned. Except, obviously, I can't because I screwed it up. So they go down there, and around here, and down there. That breaks that. And you end up in rooms like this. Glitch rooms. And you can catch the bunnies, but I assume, probably somewhat incorrectly in places, that there are buns to be found in like the northeast corner and all these other places, but I can't reach them with my limited skills and knowledge. Like down, well down here I can just dig through. And then this guy has glowing eyes and I don't know what that's about. There's more holes, there's more traps. Here I tried to get the buns to go through there and I think I did, because this is C21, isn't it? And there was nothing there, at least nothing that I could observe. So then questions become, what do I do next? Because I get this guy to go above. But is there anywhere to functionally put them to do anything useful? I'm not entirely sure. Like this room, this room is begging for me to put rabbits in that top left corner. So perhaps I will try that now. So for a start, I can bring these guys up. Now, I don't know if I want both or just one. One's going to be easier to work with because once they combine into a mating pair, they won't ever be able to... Uh... go through one of these tubes. So now I have two buns in this room. I think I would like to get them. Possibly into that top right corner. But to do that, without them both turning into a mating pair like that, is gonna be tricky. I think I can probably use the snacks to help. And I can't put traps down on these flaming tiles. That's a snack, not a trap. But I can't get them to go into that dead end because I don't have 
enough stuff. I think the better option, actually, if I reset this room with two rabbits in it, that lower edge there has three, three options, but two of them are options that I can actually exit, because if I end up doing this one here, if they end up in that bottom piece to my lower right, I can't dig out this piece. So perhaps one of the ones on the left-hand side of things here. So, if I want them to not breed, I think I need to do a snack. So, there. Then they can hang out. They won't go over towards that trap, I don't think. How can I get them to go left? Well, that's what I didn't really want to happen. Because now I can't get in that room. Or I can't get into that space. Because this one won't dig. So they're down there without me. Which doesn't help me. That doesn't help me either. So it feels like getting them separated with a snack like that is the simple place to start. What if I put a snack there and take this guy for a walk? Well, they end up there. I can't use that tile either because I can't dig through this lower one. I have to get to one of those two at the bottom corner. And I can dig one tile, but I imagine it might end up being this one that I dig through to give myself kind of a chicane through there. But then I have one other trap. Also, if this rabbit ever ends up here, it's going to run off to that snack, which is a whole other level of problem. So I am hypothesizing that this can be done and I could be here for a good while trying, but I'm gonna. I think, well, mm, if I had more rabbits, some of the rabbits could eat the decoy snacks. But my question then becomes, can, I know I can bring one more rabbit in from below me. I can bring this guy along as well. But are they going to end up in the same tile? Yeah, so they've bred now because they both think they're entering the same room at the same time. Whereas when I come out of here, it's just one rabbit not trying to breathe. And I have to assume that I'm probably not getting a bun from the top room at the same time here because I would have to take the previous bun, this one, into this room and then corral them both back at the same time, which seems like its own version of a nightmare. So, sticking with one bun... And I need my pick charge back. We dig through here. Trap. There. I think we can go the long way around here. This should be fine. So now I'm back at this arrangement. So I don't think I can bring additional buns along for this. So how do I get these buns onto this space, basically, I think? Could hypothetically be this space. Because I think if I chase them down here, they don't see the corner. They would rather come down to this dead end than that box. 
but I need to do that in a way that doesn't make these two breed yet. I could also do that, but then they go down the room that I can't solve for. So my only opener, I think, is that to separate the two of them. Then I can put food down there. So I'm going to send that route. Ah, oh, he didn't stop for the food. Why do you not stop for the snack? Do you not see the snack? You should see the snack. Okay, instead of digging that one out, what if I instead... Why don't you go to that food? Is it the hot tiles? Can you not see food over hot tiles? Because if that's true, I'm in a world of hurt. Because I don't know how to get you to eat this snack as a priority over the two on the left, you know? Because these guys won't go into the traps, into the holes, while they are a pair. This also doesn't help me. I can't begin to fathom how many dead ends there are in this room. I wish I could color code them and just kind of define what tiles are safe tiles, you know? And I can't see, see any other... Wait, oh, hold on. What about... Nope. <laughs> so that just ends up in that that I can't dig through. Part of me really wonders if I need to get more rabbits down here. Because the difference with this piece of tunnel here compared to this piece of tunnel here is that they can see the dead end of this so they won't go down it whereas these have bends because they can see the bend or they can't see the end of the bend they will pursue trying to go down it so carrot here seems to be the only way of not getting them to either breed or go down that left hole now where do I go from there? I can dig out one tile. Exactly one tile. If I approach from here, I can manipulate this top left corner before the rabbit gets here. Then they end up there, which is no good to me. And I can't pick up the trap before they end up down there. I can't put the trap on these. It just makes fire appear on the ground. I'm gonna go get my other snack. I need to approach from further to the left. Now, I think I need to put the trap down here because otherwise they won't see these dead ends. 
And then if I put the snack down there... Well, what I also might need to do... Is get this rabbit. I can't... Hmm... That just puts them back on the top row again. Which is good. That's bad, because now they're going to go left. Oh my god. They're going to turn to their left, which is down there. If this isn't possible, then... I'm barking up such a wrong tree. Um, carrot. Separate the rabbits. We can go left, over the top and left and down, or across the bottom, down and left. Those are the two options. I really don't understand why you won't eat that snack. Let me just try. If I put the trap there, do you stop long enough to see the snack? You don't, which is really bizarre. It's like it breaks line of sight, which is not something that I've experienced in any capacity yet. Every time I undo by mistake, a tiny bit of me dies inside. I just want them in this lower left corner, man. That's definitely not what I want. That rabbit in the top left, top right corner feels like something I can actually work with. But thereafter, I'm so, like, a rabbit can never stand here, but a rabbit, rabbit can never stand here either, because both of these tiles lead to dead ends I don't want the rabbit to go down. So... To that end, this seems like a fruitless task. Because if a rabbit comes down here, its left-hand turn is downwards. And if a rabbit comes up here, it would rather go forwards than downwards, right? And I can get a rabbit to go there, I just can't dig through this tile here. Even if... I could somehow come in through the ceiling and break this tile, this one, I wouldn't be able to then get the buns to go into the tunnel because there would be no 90 degree turn for them to not go down. So do I have any other insight on this room at all? I want a bun to come to here. I don't know that I can make a bun come to here, especially not with those traps and snacks tempting them over there. Alright, I'm conceding to that room. I tried. I really did. This room is a whole other kettle of fish. The right-hand side wall doesn't have anything for me. Here's a question. If I put this trap here and then 
sent a rabbit down this tube, would it stop? Oh no, it would, it would walk into the trap. That's right. That's like how the mechanic worked ages ago. We just haven't used that mechanic in ages. And this is where we started. I've accidentally captured two of these buns. So I can't do anything functional with them. Because if I get this bun over there... The problem I have is I have no pickaxe here. So even if those two destroy that block, I have no pickaxe to do anything about it. And I don't think... I can get them to come downwards because they turn left and there's no way to get them to turn left and come down. Damn it. Right. There's so much of hell that I've barely even begun to comprehend in all. Over here. I can dig this. That's reasonably interesting. I don't even know if I've noticed that I can dig that yet. Have I brought you out of there? And subsequently had babies with everybody? I have. I have indeed. I've probably even gotten you to go down these holes. Hypnotics. Hypnosis? Hypnotics? Something. This room doesn't have any regular dead ends in it. And if I want to be in that room... I can come down here. Schedule. What can I possibly achieve in this room? I can't dig out into another room. If I had more picks, I might be able to get out of that room, out of that corner. But above me is a room that is functionally useless for digging down in. So I would need to dig out that piece there. Or, where are we? We are on E22. Can I get to C22? And go right. That's C21. This is C22. Not, nor can I catch this rabbit. And this room, I don't even know what I'm supposed to achieve here. It's interesting that the top wall just doesn't have wall at all. But I don't have a pick here, so it's much of a muchness, I think. And then here, rabbits to the bottom right or the bottom left would possibly be worth something to me. But I'm really uncertain. So now just in every corner I go to, all I can see are suspicious things. Which is not very helpful. I also cannot recreate whatever route I took to get to like the strange secret underground crossroad meeting place so here's what I'm gonna do here is what I'm gonna do I'm gonna come over here tell the robot to recapture all previously captured bunnies
98 of them. All right, stop talking about the robot. Stop talking about the robot, right. Hopefully still has stuff to tell me. What? Well, that was my last update. So nothing happens if I find more babies. How about I tell you a secret if you find 120 babies? Deal. Okay, well, I wish you'd have told me that sooner. I would have spent more time looking for babies and less time. Just... Ra oh, but now I have to release all the rabbits again. You tricked me. Okay. Release all the bunnies. So many bunnies. Why do I still have one? Oh, the uh, glitch bunny. I guess I'll release that too. Okay. So, next goal for next time, because I'm... I apologize for the mess that this episode was, but the goal for next time, 120 bunnies. I wish I had realized that I could get a goal sooner, but now that we have it, I will focus on that for next time. For now, thank you ever so much for pursuing this peculiar system with me. I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.